the nugget is coming from Mark chapter 4. It's going to be several verses, so I'm not going to read them all. But it's chapter 4, verse 1, talking about the parable of the sower. I'm sure we all are familiar with it. Uh, but Jesus described the sower as the one that sows the word. And then he gave the descriptions of where the word fell. So the title of this is, uh, What Condition Is Your Field In? Uh, the first thing that he talked about was that the seed fell by the wayside. And the wayside is like the side of the field. It didn't even fall in the field. Right. But that lets you know that God's word reaches us all wherever we are. Yes. What we do with it is up to us. But Satan is always ready to kill, steal, and destroy. And the Bible says that he came in immediately and took the word. Uh, then it said that some fell on stony ground. Sometimes I don't know if our roots are deep enough because they said it fell on stony ground and it didn't have, it didn't have deep enough roots off in there. Uh, and sometimes it makes us wonder, are our roots even deep enough? So when trials and tribulations or storms come in our life, the Bible says immediately we stumble. So something we need to do is get our roots deep enough and we can get our roots deeper by seeking God more on a daily basis. And it said that some fell among thorns and was choked out. We need to know that Jesus is bigger than any care or concern in this world. If we don't know that, then we're going to be unfruitful. Yeah. Then it said that some fell on good ground, meaning that they heard the word, got saved, and living for the Lord, and they became fruitful. It's time for us to produce. We all know that we won't produce the same. Some going to produce 30, some 60, and some 100 fold. But the main thing is that we must produce. So we have to know what condition is our field is. Amen. 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 Amen.